Is this thing on? And now, to the millions and millions of listeners and viewers all across the world, it's the That's Not Christian Podcast. Hey, hey, hey. let's Ooh. go, man. Hey, maybe you know what it is today, right? What's Does that? everybody know what it is today? It's TNC's oh. anniversary, baby. <laughs> you know what it is. <laughs> we here, it's your boy Switch. I'm here with your boy Jay. I'm here with your boy Jimmy, and I'm here with your boy Ant. And what's going on, fellas? But yeah, uh, yeah. Speaking uh-huh. about CHH, let's. Uh, why don't we jump into the KB? Anybody heard the new KB album? I did. Who was that, you- Bree? <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody else it? listened, dang. <laughs> no, I, I heard it. I heard it. Yeah. We try to give everybody else an opportunity to talk. We always yeah, do all yeah. the talking. I heard oh, okay. it. Okay. I heard it. It was good. Dude. I can't even hold you. I, I ain't hear it. He not really my style. I heard oh. some of his stuff before, but yeah, yeah. Cease and desist. Yeah, just, you, yeah, you, just, say, you sound like you more you you more boom bap ish. I'm definitely boom bap. That's a fact. Yeah, yeah. So you 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 so, ride with more like Bizu and Bizzle, like Eshawn, Dayton. Yeah. All right, all right. Got you. I, Voss, Voss, I Voss got those bars too. We yeah. rock with Switch. Voss, yeah. you listen to that, yeah. you listen to that Switch music. I've been I've been listening to Switch stuff. I've been checking them out on YouTube, <laughs> okay. checking the videos. I got ah, you. Ah. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> um. I, I listened to the KB album, and I, I, I'm a fan of uh, KB 116. I mean, he's not with them anymore, but the only thing you're, you're a just, big 116 fan. You got 116 merch that you 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 got like yeah, vintage yes. 116 merch. <laughs> correct, correct, yes. Um, so I, I heard his album, and it, it's not bad at all. The only thing I kind of have a, a a problem with, and obviously this is just me, it seems like a lot of the songs are Hillsong remixes. Right. Um, he has maybe two or three on the album where they're Hillsong songs. That, that's the criticism. That he just, yeah, you know, that he put that he put a you know the great beats, the great you know lyricism, everything like that. But that's just the way I feel. I'm. It's still on my phone. I still listen to it to the uh, today, yesterday. I listened to it. So yeah, th- that's my only thing. You know. I, I heard it too, and um, I judge a uh, an album or or um, you know music by its lo- like how much I want to hear it or how much I want to listen to it. So I listened to it about three four times already. Um, and I'm a big KB fan also. I like KB. Um, to me, uh, he's still keeping it. You know, CHH. Um, yeah, yeah, he is. And and I I. I I appreciate, you know, the lane he's taken with it. And, um, you know, I'm a big Eshawn fan too. And so I, I, I appreciate the, you know, Jesus in your face, uh, lyrics, but, um, as for KB, um, I think it's going to be, you know, I'm going to listen to it for a little more, uh, but it, it, I guess like I had this conversation with switch earlier and, I guess um, it is redundant, sort of like redundant in a sense that it's typical KB, um, but but it's solid. It's a solid project. Now, did you like this project more than the last project you dropped? Mm-mm. Nah, nah, the last one was better in my opinion. Yeah, oh, okay. That was dope. Mm-hmm. Was really I was listening to everybody shot, the- nodding their heads no. <laughs> yeah. The, the last to me, one his really his last album was his best album, in my opinion. Mm, yeah. I think the album before it would probably be his second best, and then this one I would say was like the third spot. Mm. Oh, okay. I'm mm. a really big fan yeah. of KB, and I think I I agree with L D S that it was kind of redundant, kind of like it just sounded like typical KB. But I really did like like the first five or six songs. I liked all of them. Then after that, it was kind of like whatever when you get past like those for those four or five songs is it me or then did the songs just started sounding alike and like the chants and everything yeah it yeah it did for me too i listened to it this this well i listened to it uh during the weekend like i i played it once and then i listened to it this morning when i went for a run yeah and after like the fifth or sixth song it was like it just sounded like all the same 
Like the um, beats, everything, the 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 melody. I was like, wait, did I? Just- I feel, I, I feel like from a marketing perspective, though, I feel like the album got- concept is genius because yes, had, had COVID not hit, he would be hitting every uh, mega church across mm-hmm. the world. He'd mm. be performing at Hillsong, you know what I'm saying, in New York. Yes. In Australia, he he he'd be at Lakewood Church performing these. Like I could I could really see like a band up there with him, a choir and the whole nine. Like the, the show is gonna be phenomenal, but unfortunately because everything is closed. But the show he put on. Did, did you, you guys watch that watch show? It? Oh I didn't watch no, it. No, I missed it. I missed it. Hold on, so uh, no one saw it? Uh, like no. you saw it? That no was one got their tickets. Fire. I saw it. No, I didn't, you I did? Didn't. I they had he that joint on Fire Stick. Yeah, <laughs> look it up. Can we Switch. download it. <laughs> it was free tickets, man. They had free tickets. <laughs> free tickets. Right. <laughs> but, I mean, I could see Not like for Ant. Ant was reselling them online. He's like, yeah. yo, I'm reserving I'm them. Selling the links. <laughs> man, that's not Christian, bro. Right. I'm, gonna hey. the, I'm gonna mail to everybody a DVD real soon. <laughs> but um, nah, the the performance that he put on in the set and everything, it was. Dope. So amazing, right? I could see how, you know, what I'm saying, like you said, uh, Jimmy, if if he had, if there wasn't COVID and he had planned right. this out and he was gonna hit the road, that show would be sick. Cause yeah, man. everything about it. I mean, the the layout, if, uh, the the it's the all stadium music. Yeah, yeah. If it, if it wasn't for COVID, this would probably be the best selling CHH album. And, just, be, just because of the CCM, and I have to check it out now. Yeah. yeah, and since you since you watched the the, the concert or whatever he had, uh, yeah. would you pay for that like virtually? Would you have paid money to to I'd see? I'd pay for that. I, it, it, the production, everything, wow. his performance, his uh, uh, the way he handled it. Yeah, I would. Yeah. I would have paid. Yo, for that's show. that's big, bro. Because you, when you listen to praise and worship, you listen to Mob Deep. So this is this, this guy. <laughs> there you go. This is phenomenal. <laughs> 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 and Wu Tang and Method and all them and Griselda. <laughs> <laughs> Brazil, shout out Buffalo. Uh, but nah, yeah, nah, I would I would have paid for that. If you I, I don't know if you can still catch that or not, but um, I'm a, I'm gonna say this. I have a hard time paying for virtual concerts. I wouldn't do I, that. I just don't think I could feel it the same way like I'll pay to see a movie. I know that's good production, but like if I'm gonna see like a, a concert like that, like I wanna be in person. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm not paying virtual. Nah, nah. Virtual anything. You just said you would pay for it. No, you said if I went ahead and say the show, the show. I mean, it, I'm sorry. That's what I meant, though. Like, oh, you meant, like, oh as, no, I ain't paying. That's no. what I thought. You, that's what I thought you meant, because yeah. like, oh no, I think man, you I, saw it. You know, I jumped on what he said when he said, "Would you pay?" I didn't even catch the whole thing, but now I would pay to see that show. Got you, live. got you. And yeah, live because you. live, you'd be jumping out of your seat because he his energy was so crazy that you would be in it. Yeah, his How did you was, catch it? Hmm. How did you catch it? You had the um, they they sent out a link. Uh, you had oh, to yeah. sign up, and then the link was sent out, and then okay. uh, so they would not have that. to pay for this one. No, nah, you mm-hmm. have to pay for that. It I was like three days, right? Three nights or two yeah, nights? Yeah, like what? Monday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Yeah, it was they seven open three days. VIP. They had VIP that was for that that cost, but I don't, I don't know what that got you. That just got you a Zoom meeting with them. Now, can you catch it on YouTube or or any anything right now? Uh, I don't know. Like on don't repeat? Know. No. I don't know. He's all about ownership, so he probably own that thing. So he probably got <laughs> He put the intro on his um on his Instagram, but that's about it. So I'm gonna say this about KB, right? It's gonna sound outrageous, but I think KB is the truth of our generation. Who agrees with me? I would say that's the fair. truth the rapper. The truth the rapper, yes. Three said okay. no. I'm definitely gonna have to check them out now. <laughs> that's that's a that's a it's a tall. And I'm not there. talking really? lyrically. I'm just no. talking presence, <laughs> like, like, yeah, no. whole okay. package, impact <laughs> to CHH. <laughs> okay. He is like the dude that like when CHH is going this way, there's that one dude that goes uh uh-uh. uh. Get. I think it's fair. I, I like think that. He's a, I was even I say he's a better artist. But who? Josh. KB. Oh. I My guess man. if you put it like that, maybe. Mm. But nah, I think that, that like maybe, but nah. Adam, th- Adam. Just, <laughs> Adam. <laughs> the truth and KB are just very, very different artists. Right. That's what I will say. I think very, very different stylistically. Everything to me, they're very different. Right. 
But I think Switch is talking about like content wise, no? So it's like in the secular realm, right? Some people have Jay Z, right? And then after Jay Z, it's Drake, right? Kind of thing. Like, and well, it depends on who you, who you, who you, what, what kind of music you like. That's a but, jump. Right. Wow. Well, no, I would say Drake is the is like the, you go in the from secular someone, realm. Someone, you the, go from someone who doesn't write down rhymes to someone who doesn't write rhymes. <laughs> oh, man. Oh. God, I forgot. We got some bong bong. Some older right, heads man. up in here, man. I forgot you about from that. The ex drug dealer to the actor. <laughs> The Lester, <laughs> hold on, Lester, come on, piggyback, help me out, man. I will help him, Lester. Save me. It's interesting. It's an interesting comparison. Um, and the only thing I can I can really contribute to that is, uh, when the truth came out, cross movement was like on the forefront. They were the ones representing, and now, um, you got KB, and you can say that Reach Records is sort of like the cross movement, um, in the sense of like their platform. So, yeah, I can see what you're saying. And I, I mean, you're not saying as far as personality, you're talking about. Yeah, no uh, lyrics. I'm not talking about position. skill. I'm just saying, yes, the position like KB is the CHH dude. You know what I'm saying? Aside like the maybe level like, of, sorry, right. sorry to cut you off. The level no, 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 of prominence is what you mean. Like the level right. of prominence. Right. I mean, I guess that's a fair comparison. Yeah. But Compared that's to it. like to Lecrae. Me, like, that's I mean, it, though. <laughs> That's where it stops. She's, 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 she's trying. She's trying rock. to see where, yeah. where you're going. Right. When he compared Jay Z to Drake. I was like, okay, if you're really right. gonna compare them, then yes. Right. Yeah, right. <laughs> I guess when you take that, she's like, yeah, okay. I'm just saying, like impact in the culture. I'm not talking lyrics or anything else. But all right, maybe oh, okay. maybe maybe, maybe okay. what I'm saying is not the impact valid. Right. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. But you know, like the truth, like he held us down, man. Like you know what I'm saying? Like his music. Yeah edified and 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 it was so like god filled and you just yeah that part i so agree with blessed by that it, part you know i agree saying? with because i was like when i heard the album this morning i was like yo like this is like real chh yeah. right? right like it, it took me back to that era that you're talking about with like cross movement and the truth in them you know what i'm saying um which you it's don't really worship rap it, it's <laughs> it's it, it's wop <laughs> worship uh, and praise. Uh, <laughs> you know what I mean? Praise. It's why. Uh, Dude, that's not Christian. Stop it. Yo, Stop it. Wow. That's not Christian. <laughs> Stop uh, it. Uh, uh, I'm saying though. Kind of like wonder what like or question why the pushback because I did see on Twitter a lot of pushback uh when it, uh, with about his album and I'm like isn't this C H H like Christian hip hop? <laughs> it made me kind of like right. weird about it like. Isn't that what it's supposed to be? Like too much Jesus? I don't understand mm. that. Make it make mm. sense. That that part I didn't understand. But wait, was it was Jay- it wait, was it criticism? Was it criticism that it was too much Jesus? Or was it just that the album was was right. I, and I know that you brought that up earlier. I didn't see that part of it, uh, that aspect of the pushback, like uh, it sounding like uh Hillsong remixes type stuff. I seen <laughs> tweets about like I guess like too much worshipy or Jesus. Oh, like, really? Okay. And I'm like, okay. I didn't understand that part. Right. But if uh. what you are saying is what they meant, then okay, I guess I get it. Yeah. Um, I don't yeah, know. That's, that's interesting. Well, Jimmy, what was that that tweet that um someone had posted? You put in the chat. Um, was it uh? I think Josh seen you seen it right, it Josh? Applejack? Was his name Applejacks? Is it? Oh Am yeah, I, I, don't want, I don't want. I don't want. Yeah. To well, as that's, far as what, like critiquing CHH projects and stuff, and right. Yeah, I think K. I think he kind of aimed at KB. You no. Know? No, he was kind of defending KB in the sense oh. of saying the problem with CHH. I'm paraphrasing. Maybe y'all could pull it nah, up. Nah, go ahead. Go ahead. Uh, the I'm problem with CHH is that people criticize CHH music, kind of thing. And then he said, "End the discussion." All right, all right, all right. I got it. I got it. I got okay, it. I got here it. we go. He said, "Um." His first post was uh, one of the major problems with CHH is artists, media, opinions of mm. projects. Yeah. He, he followed that up. For example, people have issues with KB's album, but can't appreciate the project for what it is. It's fire. End of discussion. But then, but then he gets his own criteria then. He's like, well, when I did this, this is how I reviewed and looked at projects. So he's going to have his own nuance to how right. he wants to look at and appreciate the value of a project over what other people might be looking right for. right he has his own metric right yeah. exactly right like some right. people like the message is important first but then it's like production last 
Yeah. You know, and it's just like, okay, you can listen to something that sounds kind of weak, but hey, man, you got a dope message. That's great. You know, everybody you wanna, got their scales on that. Do rapping over an xylophone. <laughs> <laughs> what? what? <laughs> Y'all are crazy wild. <laughs> Question. What's up? Another question. Who, who y'all think is doing it like K- KB? Who else is doing it in, in that same lane? Is there somebody what's else in that lane? What specifically like him? Like, like that, 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 like, like that worship that worship trap sound or worship, like that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. No one. Nah, because no I don't know what. I think so Lecrae didn't then, kill it. Oh, uh, Social Club kind of got some joints to be sounding real kind of yeah. Um, um, not quite like him, but I mean, I'm just thinking someone close to that realm. Yeah, 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 some, yeah. Some very stadium type stuff. Yeah. Um, Seven got a worship album out. You know what I'm he saying? Hog seven. That's true. What'd you say, yeah, Jay? out to Seven. No, I was going to say, like, Cray had, well, in this last album, he had that. Yeah, that one. And then the latest one, he had that Kirk Franklin. And then the. Yeah, I couldn't do that. Uh, it was two Kirk Franken songs, I think. I wasn't um, feeling like, that. Look that, he, that he, he did that sample, you know, but but not like KB. Like KB will take the sample from or the lyrics from Hill Song <laughs> and just create another <laughs> another beat with it. Uh, it's just it's just how it is. Just He's like, he just karaoke over it and rapped. Ain't that Yo, your I church? Could, Ain't that I your home mess church? With that, crazy yeah, guy. and what switch? What's up? What? Ain't that your home? That's his home church. Hillsong. That's why he. Yeah. First of all, he's a Lecrae fan, and second, Hill he's song six, yeah. yeah, you know what I'm saying. So he already like yeah, two strikes sour. on KB for this guy. He's sour. No, nah, it's not. It's not strikes. It's not strikes because I enjoy the album. I'm just saying, like, it's uh, like that. And even even with Reach, he had like two songs that he sampled the uh, Hill song on there too as well. Uh, just saying, that's all. That's all my so thing. Less, I, mean, I, think, I love KB. I think Les is more <laughs> talking about that sound, right? Like. Who else has that yeah, yeah. signature kind of sound? Like people want him to change, but that's that's what he's known for, right? So yeah, it's that's, like, that's just lean, <clears throat> right? Yeah, I don't think anybody that I can think of right now, nobody. Uh, no, so I guess he's necessary, no. right? Agree. I would say yeah. he's necessary. Yeah, definitely. It helped me finish my workout this morning. Does it well? Yeah, he's got that. He's got that anthem. You know what I mean? That energy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. For the sure. Features are pretty dope. He got a. Uh, he got uh, Tommy Royale. Royale. Yeah. Oh yeah, Tommy Royale. I like that one. I like he that got joint. Bizzle. That joint is cool. Oh, Bizzle, Bizzle, Bizzle joint, joint is right? Oh, yeah. Yeah. About time. <laughs> <laughs> About time they have a feature. <laughs> nah, yo, they had, they had, yeah, they had. Uh, Reach has been featured on GOM projects. Uh, yeah, a couple yeah. times. Yeah. Two times. It's, it's just but the other GOM way around. Hasn't been featured on Reach projects like that. Right. Well, never. Even this one. I mean, he not with Reach. He was Sony. So it right. don't matter. Oh, don't count. Oh, no. <laughs> right, man, I'm, just I'm not even going to go there. down that hole. Just, I don't just want any more it out there. <laughs> <laughs> Just, <laughs> just observation. Don't want just no observations. Smoke. Don't send the cease and desist. It's just observation. Right, just ah, observation. Send it. Send it. If we if we wrong, just at me. If we wrong, just at me. <laughs> nah, send nah, it. Nah. Send it to Josh, not to the TNC, please. We we we're about, <laughs> we about all the smoke. Send it, Lecrae. I don't <laughs> want. I don't want any more emails. I don't want any more emails. 